this is one of my newest uh, Microsoft Excel creations. It's an X and Y coordinate algebra graph. It does the work for you. Uh, here's how it works. This field right here is the only entry field, the green section. You can enter up to six coordinates. A coordinate should be as follow. Parentheses, negative five, comma, negative two, close parentheses. That is a coordinate. The first number, five, negative five, is for x. The second number is always for y. You separate a coordinate only by a single space. As you see here, parentheses, negative five, comma, negative two, close parentheses, space, parentheses, negative three, comma, one, close parentheses, and then, of course, the next one. I have up to six of them here. The end result is it plots them. Let's go back here. Look at the first one. Negative five is for x-axis, comma, negative two is for y. The very, very first. The line that runs left to right is the x-axis. It separates Think of it as left to right or east to west. The line in the center running from top to bottom is the y-axis. It separates north from south or top to bottom. Whenever you have a negative number, when it comes to x, it's for the left-hand side of the line. Everything on the left-hand side of the, uh, the line. And on the left side of the line running from top to bottom. Whenever you have a positive number for the first number, it's anything on the right-hand side of the line that runs uh, top to bottom or north to south. For the second number, the negative two, negative two here in the first one, that represents the y-axis. So it's anything up on the if it's a positive number, it's anything to the top of the center uh, line that runs, uh, center yellow line that runs uh, east to west or left to right. If it's a negative number, it's anything below the line that runs um, east to west or left to right. So for the first uh, coordinate, it's negative 5, negative 2, so it's negative uh, 5x and negative 2y. So the coordinates here would be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, which is negative, for x, then negative 2 down, 1, 2, and there you have it. As you can see here, I also have numbers on the sides of the graph so that it makes it easy for you to know exactly where you are. You won't need to do this because my template does everything for you. It does all the calculations. The only thing you would need to do if you wanted to print that out is to draw lines uh, to connect the dots. That's the only thing that I haven't done. So once again, the only place that you enter here is in the green section. It's a protected document, so there's nothing else for you to enter. And then it'll plot the courses for you. Once again, this was inspired by the math teacher at Skyhawks Math.